Hello, welcome back to another lockdown vlog, vlog number five. Uh, not a whole lot's been going on. I haven't filmed since my last vlog I finished up for like three weeks. It's been pretty mundane, just living life, doing stuff. I'm just sitting here finishing up uh, editing for this week's content. I finally got uh, ahead for a week for once. Hasn't happened in a while with all the crazy holidays. Uh, but yeah, just finishing up the upload process. And uh, something interesting happened today, which was I bid on something on eBay and I won. And it's pretty awesome and I got a steal, a steal on this item. And I'm super pumped about it and I hope you guys are too. So I will tell you more about that and what actually happened and how it went down when the package comes in, which should be in just, I don't know, maybe like a few days. Also, this is my second go around at filming this intro because the first time I recorded it, my camera was reversed. So all you were seeing was this beautiful light for the whole time. Good job, me. Time to update some slivers. Oh boy, lots of good stuff in here. Click, 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 click. Trade, trade, trade. New deck time. What are you guys doing? We're, we're hanging out under here. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so comfy under here. Oh, cool. Yeah, I wish you could go under here with your a kid. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little big. Whoa, whoa, easy mode. Don't yeah. break my bed. Easy, easy. Dad is so happy. He, he can go in here, that's fine. <laughs> Boom, new haircut. Boom, new controller. Got you. Nice job. <laughs> Got him. Good stuff. This way. That was a close one. All right, go press the jump. Yep. A jump. There, go over, up. There you go. Yay. Well, this is gonna be the month of upgrades and new stuff. I just went to Best Buy, got myself a new phone, which I haven't upgraded in like three years. I was on like the S9, I think, the Galaxy S9. So I went ham and I went out there and got the brand new uh, S21 uh, Ultra, the best one you can get that just came out like two weeks ago or something. And uh, driving home, it's doing some updating, but uh, I'm excited. This is gonna bring some nice quality videos. I'm gonna, I wanna start filming the booster crackings in 4K. It's something I've been wanting to start exporting out. Just haven't done it yet, but I, I really wanna start committing to uh, just getting some really nice 4K booster cracking videos for everyone. So hopefully you guys like that. There it is. I saved my old phone, so I'm gonna be dual filming with my old phone and my new phone. So it should be pretty dope. Oh, yeah. This thing has like five cameras on it. It's so crazy. I told you today was the day for upgrades. I've also got a new router modem that should give my internet a nice little boost. Hopefully let me play some stuff on the computer. Fingers crossed for Warzone. We'll see about that, but I'm going to go get this sucker installed now. All right, it's here. It finally came in. Eh, it actually came in a little bit ago, but I just been lazy and I haven't filmed the video for it yet. But this is what I got off of eBay. That was such a great steal. I'm also trying out my new director's mode on my new S21 Galaxy phone, so that's pretty sweet. It's kind of cool. It's got a little face cam on it. I got, oh, if I can open it. There we go. All right. The Castle of Heaven and the Two Towers. The second set in Force of Will history to come out. And this ain't no cheap set. It's 
semi-rare. I mean, people sell it, uh, but not a lot of people sell it. And this box easily goes for TGC player, has it up around $300, uh, $250 to $300, sometimes $350. I went on eBay. There was two people that had this. I've been keeping an eye out for it. And two people had this on eBay for $400, $400. And then, and then I found one person who had a bid on it. And this bid was like 150 bucks starting bid. And I was like, I'm going to keep an eye on this. You never know. You never know. This might jump up in price. It might not. Ooh, I was the only bidder. I got this thing for 160 This is a $300 box. I stole this thing for 160 I am so happy. I got this thing half off. Insane find. Insane. And this is one of the ones that I was missing in my openings of uh, collecting all the Force of Will sets and opening all of them. So this is going to be like narrowing it down. I've only got a couple more sets after this, but hopefully you guys are excited for me to open this thing. If you are, leave a like and leave a comment down below. This is a really cool set and there's some really cool stuff to be found in here. So I am very, very excited about this one. What a great find. I'm really liking this director's view. This is going to be so cool for vlogging and stuff. But if you don't see over here, I can just switch at ease. I can't zoom, but I got a new desk that I'll be setting up here today for some new footage, some new booster crackings, a new setup, a new filming studio setup thing. Uh, I want to start filming in 4K and I wanted a little nicer setup and I've been stealing my wife's desk for all my filming. So she wants her desk back. I got my own and you're going to be seeing some, oh, you're seeing this again. <laughs> I'm forgetting that I'm turning the camera, but that desk is going to be built soon. You'll see that in a little bit here. So I'm excited to set up a brand new setup with some nicer features, film some 4K, and it's it's going to be going to be sweet. You're going to see the best Force of Will openings on the internet. No one else has as good a quality as mine. Nobody, nobody. Count on it. Oh, okay. new desk is set up. I don't know. What do you guys think about this angle? Should I go here? Have this angle? Maybe take down the Call of Duty poster? Right next to my PlayStation? I don't know. Or I come over here and I have like a nice like couch view. I don't, I'm not sure which one to do yet. But this is where I'll be. Looks pretty nice. Gids is uh, helping me try out camera angles. Should I go classic from the side? Right here? Go up in here like this? That's actually not bad. I just gotta remove the Pringles out. Or I'll come on this side. I got a nice LED light, light uh, really bright one for this lamp to help with uh, the lighting. And then I am hoping to get an overhead camera stand that'll come somewhere, somewhere here. That's gonna be, that's gonna be the tricky part. I'm not quite sure how much of a good angle I'm gonna get because I want it kind of high but I don't want it blocking my face either. It's gonna be difficult. It's gonna be an interesting setup, but I'm looking forward to it. Okay, so here was the, uh, let me move this over here, I guess, I don't know. This is the final edition right here. This tripod for the overhead view, which hopefully will just cast down, not block my view of my face or anything, and then we can have some nice dual footage going. And I also got one more thing I was talking about in this light. This thing is massive. It's, oh my gosh, it's so bright. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be nice though. This is, I'm gonna have no lighting issues from this thing, that's for sure. Holy cow, that's crazy. set is finally in and here's what happened I ordered from Odyssey games which I got two boxes from them but I wasn't sure how fast their shipping would be 
and the release date was the 26th. I'm trying to always get the new sets out the weekend of the release date. So I also ordered from a distributor company that I've ordered in the past from because they have two day shipping. I know they'll get here on time for sure. And this one actually I had less faith in because it said it wasn't gonna be out till March. I had my hope so. Luckily, both came in today, the Friday before the Sunday's uh, video will come out. And yeah, so I'm gonna open these up and check out the boxes before I do my, my opening, my video for Sunday. So I'm really glad everybody's shipping was really fast. Shout out to Odyssey Games out here in Kalamazoo. They are the stop to go. If you play Force of Will in Michigan, for sure. I don't know how far they ship, but I'm sure they will be accommodating. But here it is. Oh, ooh, look at that. Oh, ho, 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 that looks sick. So there's one from them. Oh, they gave me something. Oh, they gave me something cool. Oh, that's sweet. We'll check that out. Well, man. Magic Stone Wars Zero. Oh my gosh, I got so many of these boxes. Maybe, maybe one too many. Maybe one too many. We'll see though, we'll see. Let's see what they gave me here. They packed this thing full. Oh wow, they gave me, they gave me two cards. I don't know if you'll be able to see these very well. Forbidden Summoning, very cool. And then Determination of the Machine Lord. I'll put that up, I don't know if you can see that, but that's one of them. And then they also gave me this little promo code which is promo card which is sick awesome that's some good swag they also gave me a poster it looks like which all right way to keep a customer here oh yes it's a zero war poster oh this is going up for sure if i can open it carefully oh oh heck yeah <laughs> That is freaking awesome. I was not expecting that. That is sick. That is going right here, I think. I think so. That'll be my backdrop. Magic Stone War is going to be my set. It is going to be my set. I'm going to be opening up so much of this. Let me make sure. No, just a bunch of foamies and the rest of it. Dang. That is, that is freaking dope. Okay, I got some sweet stuff. All right, for the distributing company, they've given me swag before. But I didn't get it on the last uh, order I got from them, so who knows? We'll see. I think it's just going to be the box again. Oh, there it is. All right, yep, third box. Let's go. Holy crap. And then, yeah, just uh, no other goodies in here. No other. That's okay, though. That's okay. I'll take my receipt. So, yeah, holy cow. I am super excited to open this set up and hopefully you guys have checked out the video already by the time this vlog comes out maybe i'll still be opening these because i've got so much of this set honestly and i ended up finding a pre-release kit which i am so excited for because i'll get a nice war magic stone war playmat all the cool cthulhu uh promo cards and the pre-release kit cards and everything it's going to be so sick so look for that too I don't know, hopefully this vlog doesn't take as long as the last vlog uh, to get out, so maybe I'll, like I said, maybe I'll still be opening these boxes by the time this comes out, but holy crap, this is awesome. So I had ordered another Echoes of the New World set, and I believe the box just came in, and I got a cool surprise in here. He threw in, he threw in a whole play mat to help with packing, I guess. Which is awesome. The whole, wow, that was really close to my face. Oh my gosh, I gotta do this. Moonlit Savior Playmat, which is freaking sweet. I was not expecting that. That is awesome. And then, of course, we've got our another Echo of the New World box in for more hunting of all the band girls, that's for sure. So, hard shell over here. And then I have another soft shell over here. Which one's gonna be more lucky? I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. And now I am starting process of doing all my editing for the new Force of Will set that just came in. Uh, so I filmed last night and now I gotta edit. It's Saturday night. It's gonna be a long night of editing and exporting and uploading. So hopefully everything goes smoothly with that. <laughs> oh, I just finished four hours of editing and now it's on to the long night of exporting in nice QHD quality, which takes, I don't know, it's probably going to take like 
six hours. I don't know. So I'm going to be uploading a video at like 4 a.m. tonight just so I can try to have it out by some point midday tomorrow. But then it's not even including YouTube's upload time, which it'll be uploaded on time. But the QHD and the 1080p, hopefully that will be processed and up and running in time. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> it took a full 24 to 36 hours for YouTube to process QHD uh, in my previous video. So, but I'm pretty happy with the video. It came out pretty good. Um, I was a little tired. I was filming at like 1 a.m. <laughs> I keep just doing these late night booster crackings. It's not ideal. It's not ideal. So I'm going to go make some pizza rolls. Try to eat something because I've been starving myself all day just to try to get this done. Alright. Bubba! Whoa. Where's this Bubba? Where's here? You guys have a tent? Yeah. Bye. Where's this Bubba? Whoa! Bubba is dead! Where's this? High five. <laughs> well, I've been waiting to record my booster cracking all day because uh, my pre-release kit was supposed to come in, and I would rather open that, and that's what I was planning on doing my booster cracking as, um, but it was taking its time getting in. It's 7 o'clock, and it just came in. So I've been working on editing, which it's been good. I've been finally able to finish my vlog number four and then start editing vlog number five. So <laughs> vlog number five will not take two months to get released. <laughs> but I'm finally finishing up the vlog from the end of 2020, vlog number four, and uh, yeah, it's just okay. I'm just so, so happy about it. It could have been better, but I didn't film a lot during the holidays. I was spending time with the family, and I just didn't want to film all the personal family stuff, and I just wanted to enjoy the holidays as much as I could, so it's a little, like, just, like, hit or miss. There's some good moments in the vlog that I'm I'm happy with, but it, um, I feel like it could have been more concise. I was happy with how concise vlog number three was. This one felt a little bit estranged, but that's just because I slacked, uh, for a lot of December, uh, as far as filming goes. I didn't film a ton. And now I'm editing vlog number five, and I'm, like, just filming, like, all the new crap I'm getting. <laughs> and uh, this will make it in that one, but uh, it's so funny. So, yeah, that's what you see up on the screen. I'm, I'm editing vlog number five just to make sure it goes out on time. But now this one feels a little lopsided because it's just a bunch of... <laughs> me opening stuff which is cool hopefully you guys are interested in that let me know if you are hopefully you are and uh if you do enjoy watching me get excited over the new crap i get uh leave a comment down below and let me know but uh yeah i'm gonna i'm gonna go film the booster cracking again late at night and uh, i work tomorrow so i'm probably gonna have to edit it tomorrow night which means another super fun late upload of another booster cracking uh, i'm looking forward to it Time to open some more packs. I didn't tell you guys about this one. All right. Oh. I got something really cool. And if you thought the Castle of Heaven and Two Towers was the best thing I got in this video, well, I think you might be wrong. So stick around, let's see what's in this thing. I know this vlog is just a bunch of openings, but I'll tell you what, this has been a good eBay month for me. <laughs> a lot of good products, <laughs> a lot of good stuff. Hopefully you guys can hear me all right. If I get in this box, this thing is a heavy sucker. Let me tell you, what I got in here is very exciting. So much tape, hopefully it's been packaged well. Oh boy, okay, oh, let's move that over to the side a little bit so we can have some room. Let's see in what order I pull these things out of here. There is a lot in here to go through. Firstly, holy crap, this is a thick one. Ooh. This is a binder full of bulk 
cards of Force of Will that I bought in a lot with some other really, really cool things. Let's see, can I get this thing open? He packaged this very well, thank goodness. So I'll bring you guys down closer to see what we've got in here, but it's a bunch of rares, super rares, foils, commons, uncommons of a bunch of different stuff. Um, now, normally I wouldn't buy any Force of Will bulk. I've already got a frick ton of Force of Will bulk. Uh, but this came with another item that is very special. Holy crap, he's got like four of each card in here. Dang, all right, well, I'll, I'll flip through this with you guys in a second. Let's keep moving on into what else is in here. This is all the Lapis Cluster in this binder. And I say this binder because There's another one in here, at the very bottom it looks like. I don't know what's in here. More of the bulk, I'm assuming. Oh yeah, all right, some of the nicer cards it look, looks like. We'll, we'll go through those in a second. All right. Oh my gosh, this is even thicker. Look at that, holy crap. All right, this should be the Rhea Cluster. He's just got a frick ton of bulk from the Rhea Cluster. Uh, all right, I'm gonna move the box down for a sec. So let's go through some of this bulk that I got and see if there's anything awesome in here. Now, there is a set in here that I haven't opened, the Time Spinning Witch, it's from the Rhea Cluster. So I, I haven't actually opened that set yet. So I'm curious to see what kind of cool stuff is in here. Sorry if the director's view is a little bit weird, but I'm sure a lot of these cards you've seen before, uh, holy crap. Oh, this is the Lapis Cluster. My bad. We'll, we'll flip through the Lapis for a minute and see what good stuff is in here. I'm not even going to go through all these. I mean, it's just the... There, it's, it's an insane amount of cards. Holy cow. There's some rares. That's cool. All right. Little Match Girl. Classic. Classic. Anything good at the end? Let's just flip to the end here. All right. He's got them all sequenced, set, oriented, and like these things are packed full. There's like four cards stuffed in each slot, which is insane. I'm excited to see some of the stuff from Time Spinning Witch, but it's in the other binder. Let's go grab that. I mean, this guy really packaged this stuff well. He padded all of this. I mean, kudos to him. Great seller on eBay. I'm really happy with the deal we made and his packaging job, which as you can see was a giant box with a ton of padding and a ton of stuff, which is insane. All right. So here's the the Rhea cluster stuff. And right on the front we got, what is this one? ACN, I forget what ACN is. Oh no, it's a little broken, hold on, there we go. Oh, that one too, probably just in shipping, okay. There, now we can flip through and see some of this cool stuff. ACN, ACN, which one is ACN, I forget. I can't remember all the um, little initials for all the sets. A, C, N, ah, ancient, ancient knights, ancient knights, duh, of course. What else do we got in here, man? All right, this is Advent of the Demon King now, I believe. Some really cool stuff. Here's Time Spinning Witch. All right, we're into some of the Time Spinning Witch. So there wasn't any J rulers in these bulk sets. I believe we do get some foils, um, but probably, you know, all the best stuff is taken out, honestly. Uh, but that's okay. I didn't buy it for all this bulk, which you'll see why. <laughs> it just came with as an extra bonus. And as you can see, it's time for me to start sorting cards. So I bought a bunch of boxes and stuff to finally start putting these things away. Uh, long overdue. Start putting them all on my Force of Will shelf. All right, sweet. Now we've got this little mini box here. I think this has all our really nice foils and stuff. So let's check that one out. I may need an extra hand for these. I don't know. These look like, oh, 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 hello. Oh, hello. That is a, a great looking one. Give me some focus on that, please. Thank you. All right, I'll, I'll turn off the face cam for a minute so we can get some nice footage of these cards that I'm getting here. Are they full of all of this? I don't have this promo, actually. This is one I didn't have, this Happy New Year one. That's awesome. Okay, so I just took it out of the little sleeve that's in, and here we go. Yeah, here's all the good stuff right here. All right. Seal of Wind and Light, really cool. I'm like shaking right now from what I'm about to show you. Hey, Persephone, I don't have that one. That's awesome. Yeah, we've seen you. That one's pretty cool. Hey, I've got you, Gawain, Night Dude, Darkness Magic Stone, pretty sweet. And Rabbit of Moonlit Nights, is that a promo? No, it looks like just a regular. Cool. 
And we still got all of this. Like, what? What is all this? What is it all? I think it's just extra bulk. Let me see. Here's a few others that I found in mixed with the regular bulk. Some Excalibur, Heavenly Instrument, which is a cool card. And then this dude over here, Interdimensional Apollo Vessel thing. Pretty sick. He's got like triple quadruplicates of all these cards too, which is insane. All right, so some of the other ones that were put into sleeves here, we've got a ton of Memorias and Magic Stones, like the nice ones, the nice ones that actually would have maybe some value. But look at all these. All these are foil, full arts, really, really sweet. Holy cow. Let's move on to, looks like some foil stamp stack here. Let's go into those. Yes, so a bunch of full art foils. Look at all these things. They look amazing right now. I mean, Come on, Medusa, classic card. Oh, man, this is just insane. What a crazy bulk lot. I mean, I know these aren't all very highly valued, but still, this is freaking awesome. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned the rest of this. All this over here that was in the box was just like more random bulk that he just couldn't fit into the binders. So all fully bubble wrapped. Nice, nice. If you can guess what this is, and if you did guess, leave a comment down below and uh, let me know if you got it right. I gotta slice this thing open, so hold on a sec. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. The decisive battle of Valhalla. The most rarest and sought after set in Force of Will. Holy crap, I found a good price on this, and it was only with the bulk, which is, explains all the bulk that came with it, but. The most rare set in Force of Will history, the most expensive set in Force of Will history, and I was not expecting this to, to get this anytime soon, uh, but it kind of fell into my lap and at just the right time, and here it is. Holy crap. I hope you guys are ready for an opening with the rarest set ever, because it is coming. It is coming. It is going to be awesome. I am so, so excited for this thing. And this one. Yeah, I got two. I got two of the rarest set ever. Holy frick! This is amazing. Oh my gosh, leave a like if you're excited for these two suckers. Yes, I got a steal of a deal, a pretty good price on both these boxes, including all this other bulk and all these other rares and all this other stuff. It is absolutely insane. I am super, super excited. This is so freaking awesome. I really don't know how you can top that ending uh, with this amount of goodies that are just sitting in this treasure trove behind me that I've been collecting and opening for you guys, but I mean, we got so much, so much to open. I'm so excited and I'm hoping the channel keeps growing because I really want uh, these videos to get more views and uh, more support and force of will in general, more support, more views. And it's already starting to go up and uh, become a more popular in the seller's world again, whereas investors and things like that are starting to get back on board as the tides start slowly moving that direction from what I've been seeing which is great, which is really great. And I'm just glad I snuck in and got all these boxes before they start disappearing again. Um, holy crap, though. What a way to, to end it all off. I know, like I've said, this is just a giant like opening video, but I do hope you guys enjoyed and share this around in the Force of Will community uh, if you do see this and let them know what we have going on on the channel if they're interested in seeing these wild unboxings that we got coming up. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that vlog and I really do appreciate the support you guys have been showing and just make sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed. I do appreciate it. We're trying to get to the 1K still. Uh, so anything you can do by just clicking that button is, is really helpful. So I do appreciate it. And yeah. Hopefully you guys uh, stay tuned for the next vlog. Hopefully, <laughs> I think I'm done buying for a little bit uh, because these these were expensive. It's let's be honest, they were expensive. So, but uh, yeah, I'm uh, oh man, I'm just stoked. I'm just stoked. I hope you guys are too. So, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for checking out the vlog. Stay tuned for all the content coming up. Remember, Sunday booster crackings every Sunday. We're filming in 4K now. We're getting it done. You know, I'm getting on that grind now. We're working it out. So, stay tuned for more, and we will see you guys in the next video.